Galaxy Note 10 Plus. Unboxing, setup, and impressions. Got that coming up next. I recently got my Galaxy Note 10 Plus and could not wait to get to it. So we're going to take a look at the unboxing, a look at the setup, and then some of my impressions, including something that I wasn't real crazy about. So let's, without any further ado, let's just jump right into it. Okay, today we're going to be doing the unboxing of the Galaxy Note 10 Plus. Okay, let's see what's all in this guy here. I'm going to use my handy dandy butter knife to break the seals on the box here. Okay, let's see what's inside here. This looks like an information packet, and there's the uh, SIM removal tool. There's all the pamphlets that come with the phone, and this is a Verizon, this is my carrier. Is there anything else in there? That's it for this. Okay. And here is the phone itself. And you can tell I got the that incredible glossy side. Alright. Let's take a look and see what else is in here. And we have the adapter here. Now this is the this is the 25. This is this is not the 45. It does not come with a 45. And here is the USB-C cord. And here are the earbuds for this. Now let's take a look in here. You have the dongle for the USB-C right here. And in here, these are spare tips for your S Pen. And this is pretty much the unboxing for the um, Galaxy Note 10 Plus. Let's go ahead and take a look at some things again here. Here's the phone. Got the directions over here. Earbuds, USB C cable, adapter, dongle, and spare tips for the S Pen. So let's go ahead and get this um, set up. Okay, we're going to go ahead and get the phone powered up here. Takes you through initialization here. And it's activating my phone right now with Verizon. Okay, the device is activating, so we're going to hit next. You can restore the settings and contents from your old device. It will not be difficult. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and get this set up. We're going to use. Um, Samsung uh, smart switch here and transfer the from the old phone Over to the new phone. We're going to do this wireless Open smart switch on your old galaxy and enter the pin shown below. Okay Bring the rest of your data after setup done bringing your settings bring the rest of your data tap the notification finish setting up your phone Connected. Account's been added. And it's restoring right now. Going through some Google services here. And we are restoring. It's underway. And yeah, Note 10 Plus is saying adding finishing touches. This may take a few minutes. It's coming up with Verizon services. Yeah, I'm sure we got a lot going on here. Okay. Let 
it's installing the apps right now. And I'm going to go ahead and set display. I'm going to go ahead and change the screen timeout. We're just going to do this for 10 minutes for now so this doesn't bug out on us. And it's going through the Google Play Store and apparently I have 150 apps. So we're going to go ahead and download all those right now. Well, the transfer was successful from the Galaxy Note 8 to the Galaxy Note 10 Plus, and I have my phone set up. I verified all the apps are there, all my pictures are there, um, all my files are there, and it's looking very good. The first thing that you notice about the Note 10 Plus is the incredible display. Now, on the side, the power button and the volume button are on the same side. They are on the left side of the phone this year. And to do a screenshot, you have to hit the power button and the down volume button. Now, watch what happens right here. I actually turn the volume down instead of taking the screenshot. So you have to hit, and I tried it again here, and you can see it flash and it'll do it correctly. Now you can use the S Pen to do a screenshot as well. Uh, overall, the fit and finish of the phone is absolutely fantastic. I can see that's the bottom of the phone, the speakers down there, uh, there's the side of the phone, and the top of the phone right there. The speakers are on this are fantastic, and we'll take a listen to that. This Aura Glow is just absolutely fantastic. That's why I ended up getting a clear case. Now, something else that made itself very apparent early on was the 12 gigabytes of RAM. Going between apps is absolutely seamless. It's fast. No matter how many things I've thrown at the Note 10 Plus, it's been able to handle them. Having Twitter open, having Facebook open, having Notes open. You can't help but be impressed with the speed. One of the other things that really impressed me were the speakers. Got that coming up next. absolutely sounds fantastic the note 10 plus's camera was raved about in early reviews and if you take a look at these two pictures that i took using night mode you can see why it is absolutely stunning overall i can't say i have ever been more pleased about a phone question of the day what is your favorite feature of the galaxy note 10 plus let me know in the comments section below if you like the content from today's video, please make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and tell others about the channel. Also be sure to check out my Facebook page where I do post daily updates regarding technology and anything in the technology industry. Also be sure to check out my Twitter account where I do post daily updates and Instagram as well. Thanks so much for watching and remember, it's a great day for technology.